No weapon formed against us shall prosper in Jesus' name. Amen. <laughs> no weapon formed against us shall prosper in Jesus' name. Amen. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening, family. Welcome to the mental house with me, your host. And for those of y'all who know me personally, um, or who have uh, come accustomed to my conversations over the last few years, y'all know that I cannot stand the um, abuse of children. May because what we do to the babies, um, I think Maurice White said it best. Child is born with a heart of gold. Way of the world makes his heart so cold. And I know a lot of y'all heard that baby at the beginning of this. Oh, let me get through it. That was Krishan Rock and her little baby. Krishan Jr., Jesus, whatever. And for her to say... No weapons formed against us shall prosper in Jesus' name. I want to know where the protective services are in this case. Clearly, clearly, this baby has issues already. And anybody that's been around enough kids or as a person who's raised kids and grandkids will know when you're looking at a child, the, the baby looks like it has alcohol fetal syndrome. I'm just going to tell you that right now. And I'm very familiar with the diagnosis because I had somebody in my home with alcohol fetal syndrome. Okay? I'm very familiar with the diagnosis. I'm very familiar with the behavior. I'm very familiar how it looks in babies on, on a physical level. Their ears are down low. Their eyes set far apart. They make sounds as opposed to uh, distress sounds, as opposed to normal baby sounds. And I'm going to give you an example. I have a Connie Corso female who's had litters of puppies. So she's very in tune to babies, extremely. I play babies on the TV. I play them. And she never gets in distress. When that when this dog heard Krishan's baby making those sounds, she got up from where she was at. She came in here and she started crying. <laughs> Doing that type of stuff. I ain't never seen my dog do this before. Which further lets me know that this woman who sat there and drank that alcohol, did that cocaine, all them drugs carrying that baby and now the effects is on that baby and ain't nobody doing nothing about it. The child should be removed from her care. That's what I'm saying. And I would be less, I would be less than a grandmom if I didn't say it. Something is wrong with the child, y'all. Y'all know it. This ain't no laughing matter. I just did a video on Patreon talking about we teach people how to treat us. Except for kids because they don't have a choice. They're actually hostages. In a situation that they didn't even ask to be in. 
most women that want a baby, as soon as they find out they're pregnant, if they didn't clean up before they had the kid, at least when they are having the kid and about or having a child, that's what I should say, they should they they stop. When they find out they're pregnant, they're not continuing to drink. They're not continuing to smoke. They're not. Unless you want what Krishan Rock got at her house over there right now. Masquerading as a normal baby. The baby needs to be in therapy right now. It needs to be out of her. And I, I don't like the blue face dude. At all. And you shouldn't even been doing that unprotected with somebody that was drinking and acting that way unless you really didn't care. And because I know you had strippers in the house with your other little boy, according to the word on the street, then I already know. And the TikTok video, I already know. You don't care. Your kids are smarter than you. And to allow this woman to bring this baby into the world, it's like, I can't expect much from Krishan because her mother didn't do right by her. I know y'all going to get mad about this, and guess what? I really don't even care. It's really about that child. The baby needs help. And it don't need to grow up in a more messed up environment. And grow up in it when it's already going to have physical challenges in the first place. I saw the baby and I'm supremely disturbed. And y'all can say what y'all want to say, but I, I, I wouldn't be a watch person at the tower if I didn't say nothing. About what I see is wrong. And now. We're affecting. Babies. To come up in an environment. That is already set up. To see you fail. You didn't give him no tools. Already. Because he's starting behind the eight ball. And anybody. That want to challenge what I say. Tell me if you've had any experience with an alcohol fetal syndrome child. Tell me if you've had any problems with children with severe extreme cognitive issues. Because if you haven't, you don't even have an opinion. I don't know how many of y'all have seen the video or her TikTok video. But the baby needs help. And it needs to be an intervention. You can't kiss the baby uh, sickness away. Now you want to kiss them all in the mouth. And kiss them, kiss them, kiss them. You can't kiss away the detriment that you've done to that child. You can't kiss it away. And you need to remove yourself if you any kind of woman at all. At least let that baby get the help that it needs. You don't want, you wasn't ready for no baby. You couldn't even stop getting drunk and high while you knew you was pregnant. And now the effects of all that is on that child. I'm done. You can take it or you can leave it alone. If you like what you hear, please subscribe and share my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Poor baby.